my friend Werner from Frankfurt. Uh, he's the guy who teach me how to vlog. First time I meet him in uh, Mabea, we were uh, filming on a helicopter with him and uh, it was very exciting. I enjoyed it very much and I thank him all the time for getting me into this. <laughs> uh, now finally we decided to make a vlog together. Uh, we are also now very good friends for a uh, few months and uh, every time uh, he's here we have a, a meal together and we hang out a little bit. So um, we are now trying to find some synergies and try to do some business together. He's interested in some deals in Scotland and uh, I'm also interested to help him find some real estate in Spain which we're working on to find him something for his projects. So uh, really good friend and uh, also inspirational for me because uh, he's the guy who taught me into how to get into vlogging. It was something new for me and still he gives me some tips how to do it better every time. So <laughs> thanks for that buddy. <laughs> Und wenn du dann gewohnt bist natürlich große Autos zu fahren, dann oh. uh, uh, uh. Yes, immer ein bisschen. Also ich, ich tue mein Ding, mein Rolls Royce, lasse ich auch nichts mehr. Ich habe ihn die Woche jetzt auf dem Hänger, hatte ich dir ja gesagt gehabt vorgestern, ne? ja. wo wir uns getroffen haben. Aber ich bringe dir nichts mehr hierher. <lacht> ich bringe nichts mehr hierher, ja. ehrlich. Ja, hier ist ein bisschen so eng immer. Und das hier ist ja noch, das ist ja noch hier noch enger wie bei mir. Geiles Auto, Werner, wo geht's denn hin? Was essen? Ich bin höchst aggressiv jetzt. Und wenn ich nichts zu beißen kriege, dann flüge ich gleich aus. Wir müssen jetzt rum, jetzt pack deine Kamera ein und geh mit. Alles klar, dann, sehen wir, dann sehen wir uns beim Essen. Ja, auf. He's hungry now. Where are you guys going? So I'm gonna take him to eat now, because this guy is hungry. He needs a big steak. You see the size? <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> a very tall guy but still somehow we managed to fit him inside it even with the hat <laughs> Sie kann nur Englisch sprechen, ne? Ja. Do you do you like Harley Davidson? <laughs> you remember the Harley Davidson game you were playing in the in Poland? That one with the video game? And I said Uncle Werner, that's Uncle Werner. <laughs> do you like Harley? <laughs> So, Werner, ready for your flight today to Germany? Of course. <laughs> He's a very tall guy, uh, over six feet. How tall are you? Six feet at least, no? Huh? Zwei Meter. 1,89. Uh, so al almost two meters, and this is a really short plane, a uh, small one. So it's gonna be a bit of a challenge to get him in. Let's see, we have to duck him down and push him in, but we manage eh, today somehow. And let's see uh, how the flight will be, because this plane is uh, the smallest private jet you can get. And uh, I have the biggest guy you can find to put inside it. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> He's dreading this flight, I'm telling you now. Oh. The last time he was flying a big latitude and now I push him in a little Citation Mustang. 
<laughs> He's not gonna like me after the flight, I tell you right now. <laughs> I think we're gonna fit him inside today. What do you think? Probably, yeah, probably. <laughs> so, Werner. Let's so. see. Ah. Passt doch, hundertprozentig. So, we have a really tall guy, and as you can see above him, we still have space. So the jet isn't so bad, huh? says not did a good job. Even six foot five inches, I believe, is okay here. out of Spain now and we fly to Lyon as you can see on the screen there zoom in a bit we just departed out of Malaga no, that's the aircraft we're en route to Valencia now we're gonna fly past Barcelona and hopefully we get a shortcut over there to save some fuel from the ATC we're gonna request if they can give us a shortcut and then we land in Lyon that's where we're gonna fuel up and then we continue to Frankfurt as we're a little bit heavy today, we have a couple of extra passengers, so we're going to need to take fuel on the way, because this aircraft is really good. It's a small aircraft, really fuel efficient, and it does a lot of trips in Europe between two countries very easily, but when you have a lot of people, Malaga is a little bit out of range, so we need to refuel sometimes. Pascal, you enjoy the flight? Sure. Take off. <laughs> 